What's up, guys? Welcome to another edition of Vintage Breaks. This is Johnny Five coming to you live from the 459 here in central New Jersey. Um, it is a cloudy day today, so it'll change of pace. <laughs> it was a 90 degrees average this whole week. Uh, I'm not complaining because when winter comes, man, I, I will miss the heat. So today is going to be <laughs> a lot of breaking. We have a lot of packs to uh, catch up on. Um, the first one off the bat will be the 1976 Topps Football Cello Pack. Um, and the reason is because it is a graded pack and Layton is going to be leaving soon So I need him to break this so we can open it up. Uh, I am not trying to break this case Not enough experience on my part But uh, we'll get that open first and then we'll go through the rest of the packs, which will be um, Easier for me to do so before I do that and call him out We do have a snapper um, we're gonna be here for a couple hours. Uh, the first snapper for the, of the day will be this 1989 Upper Deck Ken Griffey Jr. Rookie Hall of Fame card. Um, it's going to be the first 25 entries at $25. Hey, what's up, Chris? So basically, all you gotta do is spend $25, and your name will be entered. Once I get 25, I cut it off. It is first come, first serve. So if you spend two hundred dollars, you're getting, you know, eight entries. So um, there's no limit. I just need to get to twenty five. So let me put it here. First twenty five. It is four oh four when I went live. Uh, let's just highlight this real quick, so you guys can see. All right, there we go. We're all set. Hey, what's up, Plow King? Welcome to the show. Glad you guys uh, are able to join us. It's pretty early. Uh, it's 4 p.m. here. On the West Coast, people are still probably at work. But if you could join us, great. If not, it's okay. You can see us later. Uh, check, check us out on youtube.com slash vintage breaks. You can see the live session as well as the individual breaks that we did from last night, which uh, I believe was uploaded this morning. And anything that we break today will be uploaded later this evening or maybe tomorrow. Um, but it is going to be a long weekend for everyone, I hope. It is Labor Day weekend. Um, Curtis Rain job. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, first of all, I uh, just wanted to give a shout out to a couple of new customers. Uh, Brian who uh, actually called me earlier, wanted to ask how the whole concept works. He's intrigued. He actually bought a personal pack, a 1988 Fleer basketball personal pack. I'm going to open that next after this 76 Tops football. Uh, Layton's gonna jump on real quick so he can um, crack, it out. Crack, out, crack it out of the PSA holder and then we'll get to it. So John, in a, in, we'll have to see what time Jules gets down here with Crosby. But if possible, we may have a very special guest breaker today. That is my son Crosby. Oh, we'll not necessarily awesome. break, but I'll try to get him to come on and say hi. See, we got my Friday ball cap. Looking forward to the JETS season. Hope everyone's looking forward to a fun weekend. It's raining down here in Jersey today. But as I told my wife, it doesn't matter. We get to cuddle, hang out with our son all weekend. We'll watch movies and eat popcorn. I'm not too worried. <laughs> hey, Sal, how's it going? Plow Killingly, so Phoenix. Hey, Chris, how's it going? BP? Shake it. So let me get this. Uh, this is for 76 Tops Football Pack 10. Okay. Pack 10. You know, John, we've had some great hits in the last several months. Mm -hmm. But one of the ones that is eluding us is Sweetness himself. I hope I break that today. Yep, I hope so too. And I think I mentioned the other day off camera that I've been calling my son Sweetness. And obviously he doesn't know anything about football. But I was asking him uh, if he likes it. And I said there was a very famous football player named that. I was trying not to be destructive, John, but sometimes there's just no other way to do it. As for those of you watching, you're in for a very fun afternoon. 
We're leading off here with a 76 football, and normally that would be a highlight. However, we have 1970 Tops basketball. A pair of packs coming up, going out to our good friend William from PA. Wish him the best of luck. Oh, I wish, Brian. Are you kidding me? If we had Sidney Crosby stopping by? <laughs> My son's three and a half, so he's a little bit shy of... Uh... Oh, wow, that's really cool, P.S. I would love to take a look at that uh, image. wonder if we can get a break on that. Yep, we are in Somerset, about a mile from Rutgers campus. Probably not even a mile, a little bit less, actually. A little deposit there. I'm going to try to clean up, clean up my shrapnel for John. Yep, Scarlet Knights. College football season begins this weekend. I was talking, talking to our good buddy Chris, who was in town from Freedom Cardboard the last few weeks. He's watching his boys from Bama play tomorrow. He's excited. A cheer generally for Rutgers and Miami. Here we go. 1976 Tots football cell. Johnny Five is going to take over from here. Tell you about the uh, Snappa Happy Hour Special. Cool. Thanks, Nate. There was the closer. Did he put on the goggles? I don't think he put on the. Did he put on the goggles, Rob? Did you? T <laughs> I don't think he put on the goggles. That guy's crazy. All right. Uh, let me clean this up, folks. We don't want the cards to get damaged by any of this plastic. Okay. All right, pack 10. Let's get ready. Hey, what's up, Jason? Uh, is there a custom break price, or is it the equivalent of buying all the spots before any Wells does? <laughs> Individual. Yeah, so Jason, um, if there is a discount, it will be in the actual listing uh, where you check out. If there's nothing there, then there's just no discount. Um, usually he does that for like the high-end stuff, like the set breaks, stuff like that, but not for the individual packs, not anymore. Um, and it is first come, first serve, so, um, you know, if you if you want to get a personal pack, you know, you can email us, let us know ahead of time before we go live. Um, you know, info at vintagebreaks.com and let us know, hey, this is Jason. I want to get a personal pack of, I don't know, 1993 SP uh, before it sells out. Can I get one? We'll talk to you later. We'll see what we can do. And, you know, that's probably the best way to find out. So make sure you email us first. All right. Time to get the names. Pack 10. All right. Sal Salino. I think Sal. Hey, there you are, Sal. You're in there. All right. Good luck to Sal, Aaron, Jim, Fad, Josh, Travis, Brian, and Dino. Here we go. So, first person on top of the list will get the um, OJ, not OJ, the JJ, not the OJ, the JJ, JJ Jones, all right, that's the first card on top, problem Jason, all right, here we go, can we start with the sevens, no, 11, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Dino, you get the first card on top, my friend. Oh, that's not it. That's it. At ten. All right, Dino. That JJ Jones is yours. Nice and slow. 
There is no rush. Beautiful. All right, where's my cover? Okay, Dino, here we go. JJ Jones, that's promise for the Jets. Aaron, second card. Essex Johnson for the Bengals. It's pretty nice on the centering. So like a hairline off top to bottom. Um, but overall, nice card. Travis. Jim Lynch. Part four, Sal. Marlon Briscoe. Just a little off center left to right there, Sal. Nice, Matt. Glad you got it. Make sure you put it on Instagram, your 55 Bowman. Blow it up, Matt. Just blow it up. Pull up your social media, please. <laughs> Make sure you tag us on Facebook or Twitter or uh, Instagram, whatever social media you use. All right, Dino, you're up. Robert Newhouse. Robert Newhouse for my Cowboys. Josh. Just spoke to Josh earlier. Shout out to Josh. Freddie Solomon. Freddie Solomon. Josh, I hope you used the uh, the break credit. Hey, what's up, Jim? Aaron, next up. All right, the NFC Championship. Cowboys versus Rams. Cowboys just destroying them. 37 to 7. And there is Staubach in the picture. Thanks, Matt. Appreciate the love, man. Dino. Bob Barry. Bob Barry. Hoping to hear some screaming, John. <laughs> Matt, I can't wait either, man. So, what time is it? Are you East Coast, Central, West? Uh, I mean, we're gonna be here, I think, to like six thirty. Uh, Matt, will you be home by then? Because that would be great. Card nine, going to Jim. Wow, Jim, perfect timing. Here we go. Your card is up. Emmett Thomas. Emmett Thomas for the Chiefs. I'm hoping to get sweetness from this pack. We're halfway through the pack now. Matt, you're East Coast, so would you be home by then? Would you be home before 6.30? Jim, I'm glad you got him, man. Dino. Get the gum. Wally Hilgenberg. The reach just collect. May I be of assistance? It's a little off center there, Dino. A little off center. Yes, we do have something. Aaron. All right. Phil right. Villapiano. Villapiano. <laughs> All right, Matt. That sounds good. 
You do you, my friend. You do you. All right, fat card number twelve. Tom Mack, all pro. So Tommy Mack's Hall of Famer. Uh, Jim got his fifty-five Bowmans. Very cool. Very happy. Matt got his, but he's still at work. The white sign for it, uh, but he's not gonna be able to see it until you get maybe tomorrow. That's cool. <laughs> so he's excited. He's excited. Brian, card thirteen. Matt Moore, for the Dolphins. Jim is <laughs> anti-social media. <laughs> hey Jim, it's okay, man. Ain't nothing wrong with that. People like the privacy. I respect that. Matt's gonna tag us when he. Oh, that's really cool. Thanks so much. Travis, card fourteen. Wait, is Jim on right now? Mm-hmm. So get out of here. So listen to this. So Jim bought cards. He was cleaning up, I think, like a storage facility or something like that recently. Mm-hmm. He found some unopened cases. He bought from my former boss, my first job after college, Mark Murphy. He found the guide that I used to do the research, and he had it. <laughs> that's cool. So Jim, don't lose that guide. If you ever don't want it, please, we're happy to buy a second copy here in the office. We have one copy. It's like the Bible here. That's awesome. Yeah. Hey, what's up, Bob? Welcome. Uh, card 15 going to Travis. I'm hoping to bring some little Walter Payton mojo. That's why I'm standing here. Bob Johnson for the Bengals. We're down to three left. Three cards left. So, guys, remember, anyone who was in on the 54 Bowman football break yesterday, we're going to send all those cards to PSA. And when we get them back for the first time ever... We're going to be issuing a separate Vintage Breaks LOA with each card. That will picture an image of the card, as well as um, basically the date that we opened it and documenting that we did it live uh, on YouTube.com slash Vintage Breaks. That's cool. And, once again, that good idea is not mine. It is Jim's. <laughs> Jim contacted me a while back about it, and I see his point. So, in other words, John, the reason why it's cool, we can't get PSA to label a special break for every right. high-end break we do. That being said, it's really nice to be able to document it. You have a little certificate that really says, and it'll be graded, obviously, the card, mm -hmm. but says, like, when you pulled it. That'll be cool. I mean, yeah. That's kind of neat. That's awesome. Yeah. You can hang that up and frame it. Yeah. Uh, so Travis, out nice. Paul Kraus. This is probably the best center card in the pack. See? Yeah. I like that. Just, you know, when John came here, John did not know much about the condition of cards. We'll say that fairly, John. Yeah. I respect yeah. that. You know a lot about the condition <laughs> of cards now, that's for sure. Jim, last card in the pack. Unfortunately, no sweetness. But you got Horst Moleman, the kicker for the Eagles. Looks like it's nice condition. It's a uh, very well centered card, I think. There you go, Jim. 76 Tops Football is highly collected on the PSA set registry, so make sure, even in the comments, you check them out. Sure. What was the best card pull in that 54 Bowman yesterday? Sal wants to know. Um, you know, I think one of the commons or two of the commons have a chance at nine. I just don't remember the names off the top of my head. Okay. I don't think anything had a chance at a ten. Like, when we submitted the 55 Bowmans, I thought maybe one card had a chance at a ten, uh, meaning 55 Bowman baseball. Mm -hmm. I don't think any of them have a chance at a ten on the 54 Bowman football, but I think one or two have a chance at a nine. Okay. Yeah. Sal, so you can check the... I think the video should be on YouTube already. Should be, yeah. Uh, you could check it out. Uh, all right, guys. That was 76 Tops Football Sale Pack number 10. Now, John, did you uh, you announce our snapper? Yep. Because I saw a couple of folks started, uh, you know, jumping in. I want to make sure everyone understands that. So when we run a snapper where it's the first 25 entries instead of people, it means if someone spends 100 bucks, you get four entries. So I saw that Mr. Ortega uh, just bought himself a spot in the newly listed 64 Philly. Mm -hmm. So he not only got a spot in that, but he also grabbed five spots in the snapper. Yep. First come, first serve, guys. First come, first serve. Once, once I get 25, that's it. We move on to the next snapper. I need 25 entries. All right, let's take a look, shall we? Yeah, Brian. Uh, I need a better, a better screen. Hold on. Let me see this one. And here is the snapper. It, uh, first place is 89 Upper Deck Ken Griffey Jr., card number one. Second place, somebody's getting a $10 Bricker credit, which I will do on the spot. Uh, third place is an entire pack of a 83 Tops Baseball 
uh, wax pack actually. So three prizes, top three get it. All you gotta do is spend twenty five dollars. So it should be a little bit better. So twenty five. I need twenty five. I started at, I was live at 4.06, so first person up is Chris, Chris King, thank you for your purchase. You get one spot. Manuel, Manuel, he, he great customer of ours, um, he's always buying, but he never chats. He is never on the chat. It's unfortunate because I think me and Manuel will get along really well. <laughs> um, okay, so Manuel, thank you for your purchases. Who are you, Manuel? Okay. This should work. There you go. All right. Next, Jason. Jason Mayer. Jason, I got you for one spot, Jason. All right. Got to make it to 26 on this one, guys. Let's continue. As I mentioned, shout out to Brian. Brian, hmm, not sure how to pronounce your last name. It's Fies, maybe? Fies? Fies? Face? Anyways, this is going to be a personal pack. 1988 Fear Basketball Pack 58 for my man, Brian. All right, Brian, good luck. First time buyer at Vintage Breaks. <laughs> Jim, that I, I just realized you wrote that. <laughs> All right, Brian, good luck, my friend. Goes to gum. All right, first card. <sighs> Little gum dust. Is Mr. Pur Purvis Short. It had a lot of dust on it. There you go, Brian, your first card off the pack. Second card. Actually, I don't know if I recorded this or not. Did not. This is for 88 Fear Basketball Pack 58. Personal pack for Brian. Uh, first card was Purvis Short. Second card, Bob Hansen for the Jazz. So if we win a break credit, how do we find it to use it? So uh, basically, I will email you the promo code which you will use during your checkout. There's a promo code option there. Just put in the code and it will reduce the total by $10, that is second place. <laughs> cool. Wow, Jim, did not know that. Brian, next card up, Chris Mullen, Hall of Famer. Just a little off-centered. Top to bottom. Dale Ellis. Dale Ellis. Hey, Joe. 
Happy Friday, my man. Happy Friday. Vinny Johnson. Wow, how old was Vinny in this picture? Man. Vinny Johnson. Hey, what's up, Chad? Greg Anderson. Greg Anderson. Lafayette Lever for the Nuggets. I won one of the 21st, but never got the code. All right. Yes, uh, email chris at vintagebreaks.com or info at vintagebreaks.com, and they'll hook you up with the code. Brian, here we go. Jerome Kersey. Jerome Kersey. <laughs> Next up, James Donaldson. James Donaldson. Next up, Armin Gilliam. Hey, what's up, Ryan? Ryan Ryder. What a great last name. Ron Harper. Ron Harper. Kenny Walker. Kenny Walker. And Brian, your Fleer Superstar sticker is Mr. Larry Bird. Mr. Larry Bird. It was an okay pack, Brian. It wasn't the best um, that I've opened. I was hoping to get you a Michael Jordan card. You know, sorry about that, Brian. There it is, his personal pack, first time customer. Hopefully uh, you buy some more stuff, Brian. All right, guys, let's check on the snapper. Let's see, Jason Mayer was the last person to purchase. All right, got a couple more. Mr. Ryan Ryder, got you for one spot. Next up, Chad. Chad, thank you for your purchase. I got you down for 11 spots, Chad. Guys, remember, I'm going in order. My software tells me everything by timestamp. So I'm just going in order here. So Chad, you get 11 spots. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There you go. We're almost filled up, guys. Miguel, you're next. Miguel, I got you, sir. I got you for four spots, Miguel. Miguel Cuaron. Four spots. One, two, three, four. I need two more next. You know what, Miguel? Actually, I'm going to round you up to one more. You were like $6 off from another one. I'm just going to give it to you. All right, so I need one more spot, guys. One more spot, and Josh, at the last second, Josh, you just got it. One spot, your one spot made it. 
you fill that up, man. Thank you. All right, guys, here we go. First snapper coming to you at 4.33 p.m. Here we go. Let me record this. This is for a 1989 Upper Deck Ken Griffey Jr. Rookie uh, Snapper Giveaway. First place gets this beautiful Griffey Rookie card. Second place gets a $10, a $10 break credit. And third place gets an 83 Tops Baseball Wax Pack. Which, whoever wins it, if you're live watching, if you want to open it, I'll open it for you. So you let me know. Okay, here are my names. That's rope. Good luck, guys. Top three, top three. First place gets the Griffey. Four. One. Two. Three. Four. Chad Barnes, Miguel Emanuel. Congrats, guys. You are the winners. Top three. All right, so Chad, you get the Ken Griffey. Miguel, you get a $10 break credit, which I will do right now for you. Um, I got your email. It's going to your email, so you can use it right away. $10 break credit for vintage breaks. Just go to your checkout and just apply it to the promo code area. Okay, my girl, let me create it now. Ah, thank you, Chad. Congrats, man. All right, my girl. Hey, Rob, yep. can I get an 83 Toss baseball pack, please? So I give it to Manuel. And Manuel will not let me know if he wants to break it or not, because he doesn't chat. So I might I might just break it for him. Thanks, man. Okay. Miguel, go ahead and check your email. You have your promo code. Just put anything into your cart, check out, and the code will reduce the total by ten dollars. So congrats. And then Third place, Manuel. Manuel, hopefully you'll uh, you're watching. Uh, this is your. Let me just write it down here. Manuel Ortega. Manuel, this is for you. Hopefully, I get something good. Hall of Famer. I'm hoping. Okay, Manuel, I'm gonna be really gentle with this, all right? Rick Honeycutt, Cardinals pitching leaders, Jerry Morales, Lamar Hoyt, Rolly Fingers, super veteran, Frank LaCourt, Houston Astro, Astros pitching leaders, Lee Smith, Bill Gullickson, Dave Kingman, Rod Carew, 
That's a nice hit. Johnny Lamaster, Ricky Henderson, nice hit. Jim Asayan and Gorman Thomas. Two good hits, I think. Mr. Ricky. And Mr. Carew. Manuel, there you go. Am I going to pop the 72 football that I purchased or remain if we <laughs> Chad, um, if you if you do that, you gotta do it now before Leighton leaves. Or else I can't break it. It'll be broken Tuesday. So if you're gonna do it, you have to do it now. Cause Leighton is leaving in like twenty minutes. There you go, Manuel. Congrats on the free pack. All right. Could you send cars to PSA to get graded after a break before you ship them to the new owner? John, yes. Um, you would have to email uh, chris at vintagebreaks.com or info at vintagebreaks.com right away. So before we get it to shipping, because once it hits shipping, it's hard to get it back. And it's, you know, because we try to ship as fast as we can, especially since we're backed up. Um, Bob, thank you. I did not know that. So, yeah, John, we could do it. It's nine dollars for PSA grading and a five dollar shipping charge. Um, just to let you know, John, PSA is backed up by three to four months, so you will not see your card for about three or four months until it gets back to us. Um, so, as long as you're okay with it, we'll send it out to you. We'll send you a PayPal invoice, and you can just pay that off, and we'll ship it out. No problem, John. Okay, guys, that snapper is done. That was pretty quick. Uh, Chad, congrats again. And then I'm going to wait for Layton to come out. So whoever's interested in that 72, hey, Chris Roth, what's up, man? Folks, there is Mr. Troll himself, Chris Roth, winner of the 55 Bowman Mickey Mantle stepping by on a busy Friday I'm assuming Chris I, I'm surprised you have time to come into the chat right now it's 440 it is what it is man it is what it is all right 80 81 toss basketball yeah John it's crazy PSA is crazy right now <laughs> so John, um, I was just looking briefly, but it looks like I'm going to fill the snapper. Or close? Oh, that's done. Yeah, it's done. Yeah, it's done. All right, so I'm going to bring in the next one in a minute. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. So just want to let everyone know, I just got off the phone with Steve Sloan, the president of PSA. Okay. So not this upcoming Wednesday, but the following Wednesday, we have a very special show planned. We'll start letting more details. Uh, we'll we'll reveal some more details in the next few days. But just got off the phone with him, wanted to confirm everything. Very excited. So not next Wednesday, but the yeah, following Wednesday. Yeah, the upcoming Wednesday. Wednesday, not in a few days. Right. But the following Wednesday. Okay, so in yeah. two weeks. All right. Yep. So we'll guys. Be on the Vintage Breaks PSA show. All right, so guys, in two Wednesdays from now, uh, we're gonna have a special PSA show. Uh, we don't know. I, I don't know much yet. <laughs> Lane does. He'll slowly give away some details as we get, as we get closer. But it sounds to be amazing. So, uh, Sal, seventy two basketball. I think it's in here. Right? Sorry, two basketball? Yeah. No. Any, I don't know. <laughs> hey, uh, Sal, you got to tell me the SKU number. Uh, which pack is it? Because there's several. Just look in, under your orders and look for the SKU. It should say the pack number at the end. Just let me know what that is, Sal. All right, 81 ties, 51... There it is. <laughs> it is nice, Chris. It's comfortable in there, man. It's like a little man cave you got. I enjoyed it. All 
All right, there's my pack 51, guys. This is for a 1981 Topps basketball wax pack number 51. 51. All right, Sal says it's pack 10. All right, Sal, we're... What's that? It says pack 10? Uh, that's a 10 spots. That's 10 spots. Uh, Sal, uh, that's not the title, underneath the title. So it will say 72 tops, last pack, pack uh, 10 spot is underneath that. There's a little like s small caption. It will say pack, what, what pack are we on? First one would be 42, 43, 44. It should be 42, 43, or 44 around there in that area. 42, 42. Okay. All right, we're on it, Sal. We got it. Okay, let's roll, guys. Let's roll. Hey, what's up, Ramon? Welcome to the show, man. Eight, the hard way. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Justin, get the first card. All right, Justin, your first card is right here, okay? And we'll go down in order. So good luck. Let's get some Larry Birds. Let's get some Magic Johnsons. Some Kevin McHale, rookie. Let's go. All right, Justin, first card up. You do have some wax on this one. Let you know. It's Dan Roundfield. I'm sure you could take that wax off though. You can ask the guys in the chat how to do that if you're unsure. There's the wax on the black border there. Hey, what's up, Travis? Aaron. The Knicks team leaders. Aaron, the Blazers team leaders. Aaron again, Fred Brown for the Sonics. It's a nice card. Aaron, okay. Daryl Griffith. Aaron, Jamal Wilkes, Lakers. James, the Nuggets team leaders. James, Darwin Cook. Come on, give me one Larry Bird. Give me one Larry Bird in here. Aaron, Randy Smith. Jeff, Marvin Webster. Adam, Wes Matthews. Uh, what I would do is, you know, this, I don't, wouldn't do that. What I do is there are several business listings. Like, so. And Aaron, you get the last two cards, super action cards. You might want to search in there for card dealers or something. Super action card, Bobby Jones. Yeah, that might be a little bit. Central New Jersey. It's a little miscut, unfortunately. But we deal with people from And the last card, place, so. Maurice Cheeks. Maurice Cheeks. You go, Aaron. All right. Now you see 
81 Tops Basketball Pack 51 in the books. All right, I got 87 Fleer coming up and then 81 Tops after that. So, I don't think I showed you guys the... Uh, The packs on Q real quick. All right, so 88 Fleer was done. Yeah, well, they all, we also be monitoring. 81 Toss 51 is done. 76 Cello Football was done. Yeah. Okay, 87 Fleer coming up. I didn't even have a chance to finish the list, so there's a lot more, trust me. Okay, eighty seven. Pack twenty six. Okay, Manuel, Wesley, Bill, good luck. Nineteen eighty seven Fleer basketball wax pack number twenty six. Here we go. Snake Eyes, two. One, two. Done. There it is. All right, Bill. Get the first card. All right, Bill. First card right here. Pretty cool. It's happy hour style. We stepped it up a little bit. Okay. Nice. Remember, it's entries. Mm -hmm. Seven next sixteen inches. It's a nice jacket. Okay. I'm gonna do it right after this. Okay. All right, guys. The next snapper is a hit. Just letting you know. Here we go. Bill. Isaiah Thomas. Oh, wow. That's a nice card. Some of these uh, got be very tough. Wow. Alright, Bill. That is a lovely center card right there. <clears throat> that is nice. There's the back. Bill, I don't know the population on this one. Uh, you might want to take a look. But the centering looks really good. Just letting you know. Number two. Mike Minsky for the Nets. You reach just collect coming IP of assistance. Bob, shh. There's no no teasing here, man. No teasing. Um, you guys are gonna have to wait until I finish with this break to find out what it is. Uh, Manuel, card number three. Right. LaSalle Thompson. Man, the centering on this pack is amazing. Manuel, card number four. AC Green. AC Green. Wow. I am amazed at the centering so far. Bill, card five. Michael Thompson. <laughs> it's okay.
Okay, Bob's okay. Uh, Bill, Ricky Green. Ricky Green. Wesley, Otis Thorpe. Ah, uh, I remember Otis. Bill, the rest are yours, my friend. Good luck. Sydney Green. Nice looking. Man, this, these are all nice looking cards. Card nine. Sedali Threat. For the Bulls. Bill, come on. Terry Porter. Blazers. Well, this was a little off centered left to right. It's like the first one I seen. In this pack. Bill. Terry Cummings. That's better, Bob. Ramon, um, email Chris, chris at vintagebreaks.com with that same question, and he'll be able to help you out. Chris at vintagebreaks.com. Uh, C-H-R-I-S. And we'll help you out, Ramon. Don't worry, we got you. We'll help you out. Card 12. Paul Pressy. And build the uh, last card in the pack. <sighs> oh. <laughs> Gum residue. Um, Kevin McHale in his really, really dusty um, pottery, which I'm sure you could clean off later. There you go. It's a nice card. Very nice. All right. That is your 87 Fleer Basketball Pack 26. Oh, I got to clean this off. I got to get like a little brush, like the umpires. Clean up the base. All right. Snapper time. Here we go. The next card. This is the last snapper of the day, guys. Uh, we're leaving around 6.30. So hopefully we get this filled. Here we go. It is a 1954 Tops Jackie Robinson PSA 3. That is your snapper. First person on top. We'll get this card. I need 60 entries. I need 60 entries at $50 per transaction. So you need to spend a minimum of 50 at checkout and you will get one entry. I need 60 names. Um, it, it's, you know, if you spend 200, you get four entries. If you spend 50, you get one entry. There's no limit. First place gets a Jackie, as I mentioned. Second place, $50 break credit, which I will do on the spot, as I did for Miguel. Um, third place gets another 1983 Tops baseball wax pack. And go. <laughs> it is 457. Might as well mark it down. Welcome to Happy Hour, guys. Mr. Jackie is waiting. Who's going to take him home? So let's put that on the snapper. So I need 60. OK. 
Okay. So I'll just put insert 1954 tops Jackie Robinson PSA 3. I need 60 at 50. You guys can see that? No, you cannot. Nope, can't even see that either. Let me take away here. There we go. Hey, there's Bill. Bill, glad you're on. Since you are on, it's time to open up Booyah. Adriano, what's up? 81 Tops Rat Pack. Um, that's going to be Tuesday night, Adriano. Tuesday night, 81 Tops Rat Pack. Did you, you saw that one, right? No. No? I don't know if it's sold out. Hold on, Andrew. Let me just take a quick look. See if it's sold out or not. Adrian, the football one? Because the football one has 19 spots left. So, actually, that's not breaking yet. Although, did I refresh? Oh, no, it did sell out. Oops, I forgot to refresh. Wait, wait, wait. How come I can't see it? 1981 tops. No, I didn't sell out. There's 19 spots, guys. 19 spots left on the 81 tops football rat pack. So, Adriano, not yet. We have to sell it out first. There's 19 spots left. $8. So, when that sells out, that's when we will break it. So either Tuesday or Thursday night. Or probably next week. Because I don't think it's going to sell out in an hour and a half. Honestly. Alright, so it was 4.57 when I announced it. That's your snapper, ladies and gentlemen. I need 60 entries at $50 to get in here. It's right here, Adriano. That's my snapper. I need 60 uh, entries. All you gotta do is spend $50 per transaction. Minimum 50 to get one entry into this. Hey, Ramon. Yeah, Chris at VintageBreaks.com. There you go. 54 Jackie Robinson and the snapper, guys. Okay, let's go to the board here. I got 1970 Tops Basketball Wax Pack 4. This is a personal pack for Bill. Bill, I hope you're still watching. I know you said hi earlier. This is a personal pack, guys. Um, I gotta put this on Facebook. Bear with me, guys. I gotta set up Facebook for this. Chad, let me see, Chad. Hold on. I'll check it, Chad. Hold on. No, Chad, you're good. I started at 457, so you're good. So, Chad, hold on, let me just put on the uh, snapper here. And, Chad, you get. You get four spots. 
No, sorry. Two. Uh, no, yeah. Four spots. What am I talking about? Chad, you're in. Jim, Jim, you're up next. Jim, you get one spot. Ryan, Ryan, you get one spot. All right, hey, we started, guys. We started. We gotta get to sixty. Gotta get to sixty names. And yes, good luck to Bill. Here we go, Bill. Let me just set up the uh, live video feed. Oops. So opening a nineteen seventy tops. Oh, great! You do it. Basketball. Oh, did you show him the Jackie Snapper? Yeah, started already. I got seven names so far. That's Six great. Names. So many tops, basketball, wax pack. Okay. All right, guys. So I got set up the camera real quick. Put it on the pack. Hey, Vintage Breakers. Lovely Friday afternoon out here in Jersey. 1970 Tops basketball pack coming to you live from the 459. Great, great set. This is a first series pack. Possible Wilt Chamberlain, Cream of Jules Bar, second year. A lot of other Hall of Famers. Ten cards in the pack plus a poster. Okay. Ready? Yep. All right, Bill. Good luck. You know, Mikey doesn't like that yellow. I like that yellow. The vintage break shirt. Oh, I like I'm it. I'm a fan. <laughs> Love the artwork, John, that rapper. Oh, yeah. All right. That's not coming up. Yeah. Oh, Let's leave that for now. All right. They're supposed Let's to. Let's see if the gun was... Right there, beautiful, delish. I'm gonna keep this. Let's for, save uh, that definitely. Yeah. Definitely. All right, excited. Okay, all right, Bill. First card up. Howie, gorgeous, John. Home eyes. Oh my goodness. And this is William's personal pack. This is William's personal. William, thanks so much for your support. Really appreciate it. Wow. So hair off center, top to bottom, still potentially for a nine. I have to measure. Looks good for me. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Yep. There you go, Bill. First one off the bat. That's great. Is it William or Bill? Bill. Okay. Oh, he goes by Bill. <laughs> oh, is he watching? Yeah. Oh, very cool. Good luck, Bill. Next one. Jim Washington. Okay, so William, uh, Bill, that one looks gradable. Maybe it's a hair off left to right. Uh, basically, anything in this pack that's gradable for Bill, uh, we'll grade on the house. Okay. You know, if you want, so I'll take a better look at the cards at my desk afterwards. Okay. But at first glance, I would grade Jim Washington. There you go, Bill. Next one. Rick Robertson. Los Angeles. John, these cards are coming out really sharp. There you go, Bill. Great color. Okay. Next up. Bill says thanks. Oh, our pleasure. Tom Borwinkle. And if I'm not mistaken, does he have a second pack? Yes. So we would do the same thing for the second pack. Okay. Sounds good. So razor sharp, just a hair off center on uh, Mr. Borwinkle. Mm -hmm. Next up, this one, there's no cover here. Joe Ellis. So John, I was waiting until we opened this to list another pack. I wanted to see the quality. The oh, quality okay. looks exceptional. Boss has very sharp so far. Yeah, I know, this is great. Excited. So after this pack, John, I am going to list another pack. Okay. Next up. Ooh. Ooh, I like when you say that. 
Ooh. Jerry West. Gorgeous car, John. All-star. Yep, I'm going to wait to see it. Oh, wow. Okay, so yeah, that one you should definitely grade. I mean, it's a little bit off-center, but even if it got an 8 or a 9 OC, you'd still want that grade. It's gorgeous. Color, like that green is amazing. Yeah, definitely. Fantastic. Nice hit on the Jerry West. I like it. Next up. Second year. Ooh. Bill very Brown. nice. Hall of Famer. John, I like the reveal. I like <laughs> that. You like slow rolling it. Good job. Bill Bradley. Former uh, very great nice ball. Card. Yeah, it's very nice. It's a very nice card. Hey, Joe. How are you? Next up. Fred Hetzel. Portland. Very well centered, just looks to be a little bit of staining on the top border. Not sure if that's wax or what the deal is with that, but gorgeous card. Bob Weiss. There we go. Got one left, Bill. Got one left. Kevin Lowry. So that one, the gum got the best. Yeah, the gum got this one. Okay. Pretty cool about it. Ten cards, several Hall of Famers. Brad looked nice. West was really nice, just a hair off center, top mm -hmm. and bottom. Very cool. There you go. And if William wants, we would give him this wrapper. This is a personal. You right. can have that wrapper. It's great. Bill, let me know. Would you like the wrapper on this one? We'll send it out to you since it's a personal pack. Very high end. It's pretty cool. I'll put this in the bag first. I'll find out. <laughs> okay, so put this one there. That is Bill's personal pack number four. Number four. Facebookers, thanks for joining us. We'll be back in just a little bit. If you want to continue watching us, you could do so on youtube.com slash vintage breaks. Okay. And build the poster. Joe, we are. We're going to list another one, I think, right now. Oh, nice. Jim, the poster is Jerry West. Very nice. I'm going to put that in there in the bag. Okay, Bill. Sounds good. All right, I'm going to do this one real quick, and then I'm going to do another, your other personal. Guys, remember, the snapper's still in fact. 54 tops, Jackie Robinson, PSA 3. Uh, I need 60 entries. I need $50 per entry to get into this one, and then we'll round them off at the end. We're going to be here till 6.30. Let me just get my... Actually, I'm going to leave my phone there. How do you do? How do you how you how do you buy a personal pack? Uh, Jay, you just buy all the spots. That's it. Um, if there's six spot, if there's six spots in the pack and you buy six uh, spots, that's your personal. Yeah, it's first come first serve, so you gotta be quick. Bill jumped in there real quick and just bought all of them. So you gotta have a, a quick refresh on your computer every time you're on it. If you're on mobile, it takes a little longer, I think. All right, so let's get back to. Oh, that turn off. Did not. All right, let's get an update on the snapper, shall we, guys? Last person was Ryan Ryder at five o'clock on the dot. 
All right, at 511, Travis. Travis got in there. All right, Travis, I see you. And Travis, you get five spots. I'm sorry, three spots. There you go, Travis, you're in. Ramon, thanks, man, appreciate it. Yeah, Chris will help you out, don't worry. Shout out to Chris Gilmore if he's watching right now. You're the man. He's back in Atlanta right now. I think he's he'll be back next week. Visit us again. Um, okay, so packs. So that was 1970 tops uh, basketball pack four. That was done. I still got another one. Okay, 87 Fleer was done. 81 toss up. Here we go. This is for a 1981 Tops basketball wax pack 52. Wax pack 52. Let's get the names. Thanks, Bob. Four spots left in the Mickey Mantle Greta Hit Random, guys. I would love to do that today. That's awesome. Got that 53 tops mano in there. All right, let's roll. Seven, there it is. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, Ryan, get the first card. Keith, Keith Post, you get the last card in the pack. Fifty-two. Yeah, I think a couple of the folks were asking, um, are we going to be able to do some of the seventy-two? Oh, look at that! Beautiful, guys. Are you like that? Great. Sal, it's right here. We're going to do it after uh, Bill's personal pack. This is pack forty-two. Pack forty-two. All right, Ryan, you get the first card, which is right here at the bottom. Good luck. Hopefully this one will be better than the last one. Okay, Ryan, Celtics team leaders with Larry Bird. No problem, Sal, thank you. Hope you get something good, man. Hope Dr. J is, your, is right there in your spot. Derek, card number two. Bobby Jones. Bobby Jones. Manuel. Johnny Davis. Joseph. Dan Roundfield. Ryan, Knicks team leaders. Cameron, Blazers team leaders. Is that John Paxson? I think that's John Paxson in there. Is that right, guys? Scoring leader? Jordan. Fred Brown. Manuel, next two are yours. Mickey Johnson. Hey, what's up, bros? Glad you can make it, man. Manuel, Reggie King. Oh, Russ, do we ever have a special for you, my friend? I'll do it real quick. 
54 Jackie Robinson snapper PSA 3 we need 60 entries $50 per entry second place gets a $50 break credit third place an 83 baseball wax pack all for you next up card 10 Jim Spernarco Spanarco Spernarco I like the mustache though cool mustache Hey, what's up, Adam Davis? Cameron. Roger Fegley for the Cavaliers. Robert. Phil Hubbard. We've reached just collect. Phil we Hubbard. And the last car in the pack goes to Keith Post. Bobby. Wilkerson for the Cavaliers, who just got traded that year. There you go, Keith. Guys, that was 81 Toss Basketball Pack 52. All right, next up. All right, make sure I send that out. Did I send it out? You're welcome. I thought I did. All right, 1981 tops. Basketball pack. Fifty two. All right. Okay, Bill, you still there? There's your personal pack. All right, this is for a 1970 Toss Basketball Wax Pack number five. It is a personal pack for our good friend, Bill, who hopefully is watching. Uh, he had a nice, nice pack on the other one. He's good to go, as you can see. Here we go. And Bill, same thing applies for this one. Anything that Layton says feels like it should be gradable, we're going to send it out for, uh, to PSA on the house. All right. And do I have to put this one on Facebook, too? Oh, uh, Facebook, Facebook. Bear with me, guys. Can I put this on Facebook? Gotta set it up. Can you say, do me a favor. Just let me know if it looks good on the stream when I put it up. When I put up the card. <clears throat> is it lagging? Yep. What's up, Facebook? This is for another 1970 Tops basketball wax pack. Personal pack for our friend Bill. All right, Bill. Good luck. Make sure it's recording. It is. Okay. 
Okay. Just go. All right, Bill. First card. Johnny Egan. First here. There you go, Bill. Not bad on centering. And then here. How is it? Lower. Right there. Okay, now I know. Okay, I'm going to do one more and then just make sure. Here we go. Next one. Wes Unseld. Wes Unseld. There you go, Bill. Okay. For our Facebook watchers. Next up. Stu Lance. For the Rockets, I believe. San Diego Rockets. The centering on this one looks pretty good too, Bill. Next up, ooh, nice. Elgin Baylor. Oh my gosh, it's a nice card. Next up, let me get the cover. Bill Hewitt. Bill Hewitt. Oh, you got an Elgin? Yeah. Can I see that? Sure. Let me see the first couple. And for Facebook? Good. Okay. Wow. So uh, you should let this. These are bills. Yes. You should definitely grade the West Unsell. He's a Hall of Famer. Mm -hmm. The Stu Lance looks pretty much dead money. I would grade that. Now the Elgin's a little bit off center, but still probably a straight eight. And I would grade that. So we'll grade all those okay. if you'd like. Uh, it'll be on the house. Yeah, he said he whatever you feel. Yeah, yeah, that'd be great. That's really cool. Two Hall of Famers so far. Yep. Hey Keith, Keith, did you catch your eighty-one toss basketball pack? I just broke it. All right, next up. Oh, yes. Bob Dandridge for the Bucks. Just a little off center, left to right there. Keep forgetting, I can't do that. Kevin. Lori for the Baltimore Bullets. Look at that yellow. Nice, Keith. Thank you, sir, for waiting and being patient. Next up, Mel Counts for the Suns. Got a nice card coming up next. Ooh, I'd like to hear that. Look at that vibrant yeah. yellow. Yeah, this is gorgeous. This is how I'd make my set, John. <laughs> Thanks, Stuart. Okay, next step. Ooh. Got a free throw percentage leaders. Any Hall of Famers on that one, John? Can't see. Uh, Looks very well centered. Flint Robinson, Chet Walker. Yeah, no Hall of Famers, Jeff but the card's gorgeous. Yeah. What number is that on the back? Card number four. Because we got a number one one time out of the pack. Wow. That's so, John, nice this is probably this is gorgeous. Card. Yeah. Yeah, you should definitely grade that. So, this was paid very nice dividends this pack. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Hey, James, how are you? Pistol Pete, rookie year? Yep, but these are the first series packs. So, in the first series, you had possible Cream of Dolce Bar second year. Um, Bill Bradley, Will Chamberlain. Bunch of other goodies, but Pistol Pete's in the second series. Okay. Last card in the pack. 
should be last card in the pack, but it's not the last card. Wow. So there's there 11 in this pack? There's 11 in this one. Paul. Nothing wrong with that. Silas or Silas? Silas. Silas. Got an extra card in this pack, Bill. I mean, it's happened to us before. Yeah. You have one last one more. Good old tops. Yep. Great. And I'll get one more card saver. And this is Ron Williams. It's a little bit off center and a smidge aware on the upper left. But still, that green's really nice. Very cool. Cool. Hey, John, if I could take a look through the uh, yep. Hold pack on. real Let quick. Let me just turn this out real quick. Sure. Show the Facebook. Great. Cool. All right. That is the pack. Lane's going to take a quick look. Yeah. Definitely grade Uncell, that would definitely grade Lance, Elgin. So, uh, Ball Rhino, basically, on some of the years, uh, we know the population is, you know, for an eight, if it's a lot of eights. Gorgeous pack. Uh, there's really no reason to grade the card. Um, for nines and higher, we, we, again, we have to check the population. Uh, these cards in eights, nines, and tens are hard to find. So it depends on the year. Uh, now, if you feel like you want to get it created, even though we feel you shouldn't, by all means, you can tell us. We'll send you a PayPal invoice. It's nine dollars per card and five dollars for shipping. Thing is, though, PSA is backed up uh, about three or four months, so you're not going to see your card for a while. Uh, but if you're okay with that, no problem. Just let us know. You have to email us right away. So as soon as you see the pack broken, email us. Uh, info at vintagebreaks.com or chris at vintagebreaks.com this way we can pull it before it goes into shipping because once it gets into shipping you know we're going to send it out right away because I know you guys uh, wait patiently for us so um, alright so the last thing I want to show was the poster Bill the poster is Mr. Walt Frazier very nice. Okay, 1970 Toss Basketball Wax Pack number five. Personal for Mr. Bill B. Okay, Facebook, thank you. Ross, we got a lot of packs. Check us out on uh, youtube.com slash vintage breaks. A lot of packs to break. <clears throat> no problem. Ball Rhino. I love that name. It's great. Ginger, thank you again for uh, letting him know. It's a great community we have here. Everybody helping each other out. Um, okay, so that pack is done. Hey, John, I did just list one more 1970 basketball. There is another 1970 Toss basketball wax pack live in the store right now, guys. First come, first serve. If you want a personal, you got to get it now before somebody takes the spots. Um, by the time you hear this, it's probably already sold out. I don't know. It, it just it, it is how it is. So check out the store, guys, vintagebreaks.com. All right, next up, where is Sal? I believe it was Sal. Yeah, Sal, I hope you're watching. Hope you're still on there, bud. Okay, so 70 tops. Let me go up to the right screen here. All right, 70 tops, pack five is done. We're going to break a 72 tops basketball pack 42 right now. Oh, <laughs> hold on. Let me just show you guys real quick. This is everything that we have to break. I'm going to do my best to get through it. Um, I have 79 Opeachy baseball, 80 tops baseball. 84 tops football, 
85 with Peachy Hockey, 74 Tops Baseball, 84 Peachy Hockey, 75 Tops Mini, and so on and so on. Guys, I have a lot to go through. I'll do my best until 6.30, whatever we get through. If not, Tuesday night will continue. So don't worry, things will get broken, trust me. We do not break when we're offline, only when we're on YouTube Live. Hey, what's up, Paul? South, glad you're here. Okay, let's get a break. Uh, I'm gonna update the list as I go, guys. So just bear with me. I got an 81 Toss basketball that just broke. Next is 79 OPC baseball last pack 23. So if you're in it, that's a skew number right there. It's a 23. Okay. Let's get local recording on. This is for a 1972 Tops Basketball bat Pack 42. Pack 42. Let's get the names. 42. Sal, I see you. There you are. Good luck to Sal, Rocco, Brian, Manuel. Good luck, guys. Hope Dr. J pops his head in this one. Let's randomize it six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to email Rob the names. <clears throat> All right, let's get breaking. Card number one going to Manuel. Manuel, right here. Good luck. Ooh, that is beautiful. All right, no gum issue. That's great. Manuel, first card, Dory Murray. Sal, here's your first card, my friend. Lou Hudson. There you go, Sal. Rocco, next three. Paul Silas. A little off center left to right there, Rocco. Next one, John Tresvant. You do have a little bit of stain on the right hand side there, Rocco. Jim Davis for Rocco. Brian, Brian, I'm not sure how how tough the uh, the checklists are in this set, but this one looks pretty nice. Pretty nice. There you go, Brian. Just a little off center, left to right, top to bottom, but solid. Solid card. Rocco, Merv, Jackson.
Rocco. Warren Jabali. Sal. Johnny Newman. Johnny Newman. Hey, DJ Venom, what's up, man? Oh, Steve, wait till you see the snapper. Rocco, last card in the pack. Billy Keller. Billy Keller. There it is, guys. 72 Toss Basketball Pack 42. Thank you to everyone. Okay, Snapper. Let me give you an update to whoever just joined. It is a 54 Tops Jackie Robinson PSA 3. I need 60 entries at $50 per. So you got to find something. You can group up different spots. I don't care. Whatever you guys want to do. As long as you reach $50 per transaction, you get an entry. So far, I have Chad, Jim, Ryan, and Travis. I will update it right now. Because the last time that I looked, it was at 5.11 p.m. So that was about 30 minutes ago. So let's see how many more entries I got. So Steve, if you want to jump in, by all means, $50 per transaction. So 5.11 p.m. Sounds good, Rocco. I just need to update my software. I'm waiting for it to, uh, to update here. Come on, there we go. All right, 5.11, 5.11, where are you? Travis, there you are. Okay, so Travis was the last person. Uh, Rocco, you're up next. Rocco, one. Two, three, four. Yep, Rocco, I got you. You're in, Rocco. <laughs> it's all right, man. It's so good. Don't worry, I'm not going to skip you. You got it. Adam, you're next. Adam, you get one spot. Next, Justin. Justin, thank you for your purchase, Justin. Justin, you're a little short, my friend. Just a little short. You got to get up to $50, Justin. Jason, Mayor. Oh, Jason. Thank you for your purchases. Uh, Jason, you made a lot of purchases, so I might have to open you up on a new tab here. All right, Jason, here we go. All right, I got you for four spots. Two, three, four. Jason, you're in. Thank you for all your purchases. Next. After Jason is Justin again. Justin, oh, you made another purchase, Justin. Um, so Justin, 
I'm gonna go ahead and give you a spot since it looks like you try to do a one transaction. So Justin, you're in for one spot. I got you. It's Friday, man. I'm in a good mood. Sal, again, Sal. Nice. I got you for two more spots. So what was the last name again? Is that two eyes? Yes, it is. All right, Sal, you're in four, four, uh, four spots. One, two, three, four. And if I'm not mistaken, Sal, after you comes Justin again. Justin, wow. All right, Justin, that's another two spots for Justin. Okay. Next, Joe. What's up, Joe Knutson? I believe it's pronounced Joe Knutson. Joe, I'm putting it down for two spots, Joe. John, if you want to show them, I just listed this gorgeous 1970 Top Solo 6 Series. Guys, new on the store, 1970 Tops Baseball Solo Pack, 6 Series. You got... Frank Chris Quilisi. Quilisi on the front and Daniel Stanstaub at the back. Live on the store. Alright, Joe, you're good. Brian. <laughs> There's your snapper, my friend. Brian. Here we go. Brian Dyche. You got Two spots, Brian. You're in. Sal, up again, Sal. Sal, I'll put you for another two spots. All right, we got 32 entries, guys. We're almost there. We need to get to 60. Well, it's 60, but I'm, I put the title on the top. So that's why I said 61. Knutson, Knutson. Oh, okay. I was close, man. Knutson, got it. All right, Sal, you're in. All right, that's all I got. It's 534, the last purchase. Let me refresh again. And there is more. 534 is what I was looking for. Sal, all right, Travis. Travis, you just made one purchase. Thank you. Um, that's 20, no. No, that's it. No, not enough on that one, Travis. Uh, Michael, Michael Teague. Michael, got you down for three spots, Michael. Actually, you know what? Yeah, Michael. No, oh, it's Travis. Sorry. Travis. We're looking at you, Travis. Okay, no. They didn't make it. No. 70 Tops Bass was about to go already. Oh, man. One spot left in the 70 Tops Bass. Well, that's bad, guys. Uh, 74 Baseball pushed to Tuesday. 74 Baseball probably, Sal. Probably. Kenneth, March. Thank you for your purchases, Kenneth. Sir, I got you down. For a lot of spots. All right, Kenneth. Let me just add you up. Okay. One, two, three. All right. Kenneth, you're in for six spots. Cortland, there you are, my friend. I see you, Cortland. I'm gonna open up a new tab because you bought a lot here. Cortland, you got two spots. Got you down. All right, guys, we're almost there. We're almost there. About to close this out. And the 70 Toss basketball sold out. Wow. You guys, 
killing me here. I'm trying to keep up. All right, Corland, that was 5.45 p.m. That was three minutes ago. Let me refresh. Paul, Paul Stutter, or Studer. Paul, you get one spot. Got your first spot. Dino. Dino, Dino, Dino. Why don't I see your name, Dino? Hold on, Dino. Maybe I need to refresh because I got Paul at 547 for one. All right, let me refresh, Dino. Let me see. I got William, William Adams. Is that you, Dino? Is that you? No, it's not you. That can't be you. I don't see you, Dino. Your purchase did not go through yet. Just give it a second, Dino. I'll wait, but I don't see you. William, I got you, sir. William, you're in. I got you down for three spots, William. There you go. We're almost there, guys. I need to get to 61. I need to get these right here. I got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I, need, I got 14 spots left. Dino, let me refresh. Let me see. No, Dino, it has not come through yet. Uh, let me check PayPal. Maybe it went through as a hold, maybe? Dino, you've been having issues, right? I think, when buying through our site. Yeah, Dino, okay, so. Yeah, it, it's pending right now, so. Um, I know I know you're good for it. I know you're good for it because you bought from us before. Um, so I, I see you. I see your purchase. It just didn't go through yet. It's probably on your side. PayPal is probably just making sure. Hey, what's up, Scott? We're just trying to fill up the snapper, man. I got to get to 61 on the clicker there. Uh, $50. You spent $50 to get one entry. There's no limit. I just need to fill it up to, to 60, but on the thing there, you see 61. So once it's sold out, I ran them off. Second place gets a $50 break credit. Third place, an 83 Todd's Baseball Wax Pack. All right, so Dino, I got you. Uh, I'm gonna put you down for three spots. So that's it, I got nine spots left, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Sorry, eleven spots. Eleven spots left. All right, Dino, I see you. Um, let me refresh. Eight five forty eight was the last one I got. I'm waiting for the software to refresh here. Come on. I think you guys broke my software. That's how fast you guys are buying. You're killing it. Wow, it's stuck. It's not even. <laughs> it's not even refreshing. Scott, what you in, bro? Scott, I'm in a good mood, man. Just tell me what you're in. What What did you buy? Steve, Venom. That's why. Okay, that's why. Steve, I see your purchases. All right, Steve, I got you for five spots. All right, we're almost sold out, guys. Steve, you are in. Thank you, sir. Scott, how about this? I'll just look for it. Scott, Daniels. Uh, 
okay, so nothing from today. Let's see if I get you something from three weeks ago. All right, Scott. Um, 79 baseball, 83 baseball, pack 138. Uh, hold on, Scott. I'm going to hook you up right now, my friend. That's for Peachy. 138. 138. Right. Scott, I got you. You're in this one. That's coming up next. Uh, 83 baseball. I don't know what the heck. Yeah, Scott, I'll do that pack for you. You got it, my friend. All right, let's do that real quick. 1979 tops. Pack 138. Yeah, Scott, I see you. All right, guys, I'm going to refrain from updating the big board. Not big board, the snapper. Um, so I can break a pack because we got to start breaking. All right, Scott, you're in there. Here we go. Remember, it's first come, first serve, guys. So if it fills up, uh, the snapper fills up, you know, I'm sorry. I can't roll it over. I can't do anything. Um, there's about uh, how many spots? One, two, three, four, five, six. There's six spots left. So it's first come, first serve based on the timestamp that it's in my software. So I'm just going in order. 1979 Tops Baseball Pack 138. All right, here we go. 76 baseball rack. Uh, William, not today. The rack pack, I'm not going to be able to do it. Um, I'm only, I'm only going to be here for another half an hour or so. Um, you know what? If you want it, guys, if it's a small pack, I'll do it for you. Here we go. 1979 Tops Baseball Wax Pack 138. Uh, 138. Here we go. Six. One. Two, three, four, five, six. Scott, there you go with the first card in the pack. All right, Scott. 72 basketball. Yes, I can do that. Uh, I need the I need the skew number. I need to know which pack. Just tell me which pack. Cause I have two more. I have two others. Is it pack forty four or forty five? Let me know. All right, Scott. Good luck, my friend. Hope Ozzy is right there in the front. Well, in the front on this one. Well, I always start from the bottom. Here we go, Scott. All right, it's not Ozzy. It is Bob Nepper. Bob Nepper. Congrats, Scott. Here's your first, I think it's your first purchase that we've broken, so there you go. Joseph A. Dick Drago. Ramon. Gary Maddox. Nice. Anthony. Steve Henderson. Nice, Scotty. Hope you're enjoying this, man. This is a, what's fun is breaking these packs and you being there live. For me, that's fun because uh, you get to see it 
other people can't get to see it. They have to watch it later on on YouTube, and it's not the same. Uh, card number five going to Ramon, Hall of Famer, <coughs> Dwight Evans. Patrick, wow. That's awesome. I wasn't even a thought at this year, 1979. <laughs> Jason, Bob Watson. Bob Watson. 44, I got you. Thank you. I have it next. Ramon, Mike Evie. Joseph A. Jerry Grote. Again, guys, these are packed fresh. You're not going to get anything fresher than this. I mean, you can go to eBay, but that's been probably circulated. God knows how, for how long. Ramon. Bobby Castillo. These are literally from my pack straight to your home. You can't get any better than that. Scott, the next two are yours. Expos Prospects. Here you go, Scott. That's a very well-centered card, I think. That is nice. And Buddy Schultz. Buddy Schultz. And the last card in the pack going to Brad. Jim Rice. Now, is this the last pack? Is it? I don't know. Wait, hold on. I think Tops just shorted us a couple of cards. Hold on. So, this is the wrapper, right? 12 cards, 12 pitcher cards, and one stick of bubble gum. Good old Tops Quality Control only gave us 10 cards. Should have been more, right? Huh? Oh, PK, some cards. No, this is Tops. Tops with your 12 cards. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Sorry, that's what it was. No, no, there's 12 cards in here. It's just that it was duped numbers. Hold on. So one, two, three, four, five. Yes? I just want to know, uh, do we have more spots left in the snapper? I don't think there is. Oh. Yeah, I don't think. Uh, by the time I refresh, it's not going to be gone. Okay. Um, hold on, guys. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, these were, these numbers were duped on the stickers, not Top's fault. <laughs> so here's what I'm gonna do. So nine. So Scott, I'm gonna take your card out. Scott, you're supposed to get card number 10. There's the right label, 10. And then 11. There you go. And then 12, which is for Brad. There you go, that's better. I was going to be upset if top shorted us by two cards. That's crazy. All right, this is just dupe labels. All right, there is your 79 Tops Baseball Pack 138. Thanks, guys. Uh, and Scott, hope you enjoyed the break. Sorry about the uh, mislabeling there. All right, so that's in the books. All right, let's do the snapper real quick, shall we? Because I, I believe it's sold out at this point. 
All right, I was at 55. All right. So Steve Venom, you were the last person to uh, purchase from us when I checked. Oh, okay, great. <laughs> I guess I guess it didn't fill up. All right, awesome. So, um, one, two, three, four, five, six. I got six spots left, actually. So, if Layton comes back around, I'll let him know that we got six spots left. Meanwhile, let's keep breaking. Uh, forty-four. Who was this for? 72 pack 44 it's I can't even read the name is it real snapper Adams Williams yes I uploaded I, I refreshed it I mean there's no no more purchases after Steve at 551 guys so I, I still need one two three four five I still need six more purchases at fifty dollars Ted 74 toss baseball pack 22 All right, Ted, I'm going to have to get back to you on that one. Let me just double check if it broke or not, all right? Uh, 72 basketball, let's do that real quick. Guys, I'm here for another half an hour. Uh, if you guys want to get this random off, I need six more $50 transactions. Or if you want, you can spend you know $300, call it a day. Uh, all right, so Ted, I'll, be, I'll, I'll come back to you, Ted. Just remind me. 1972 tops, pack 44. Is that what it was? Pack 44, yes. So I don't know your name. Um, is it Ross? Ross Lampy? Is that you, Ross? I know Bill, I know Rocco, and I know Mark. So I know they're watching, I think. Ross, is that you? Is it 72 tops? Oops, let me record. Hold on. 1970, 1972 tops basketball pack 44. This is pack 44. Let's roll. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. Bill, good luck. First card up. Get back to that peachy as well. No, no, I'm talking to the guys. <laughs> All right, Bill, you get the first card right at the bottom. All right, Bill. Don May, Don May for Bill. Here you go, Bill. Luke 
Jackson. Bill, Don Nelson. Look at that stash. Mark, George Trapp. Uh, okay, Ross, you got it. Good luck, my friend. You're coming up. Ross, your first card. Nice. Lenny Wilkins. Yo, Ross. Lenny Wilkins. Next card. Jim Eakins. Jim Eakins for the Squires. Mark, it's a checklist. Unfortunately, it's completely miscut. Top to bottom, as you can see. Ross, Billy Cunningham. Billy Cunningham. Rocco, George Thompson. And the last card, Bill, Willie Long. Willie Long. There you go, guys. 1972 Toss Basketball, Pack 44. Pack 44. Hey, John, um, I think that we sold out the other 70 Tops basketball. Yeah. So if you guys want to get them together, the names, uh, I'll give you another pack. I do think we should try to break that today. Okay. I'll, I'll. 70, 70 Tops. 70 Tops basketball. Hold the American check. Not out of second. And not out of the first series, Walt. Yeah, first series. Oh, yeah, first series. Back yeah. Okay. How do we get there? 72 Tops basketball. Pack 44. Okay. Changing the uh, base. Okay, guys, let's check on the snapper. Uh, Steve Venom at 551. Last person I saw. That's it. <laughs> All right, guys. So, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six spots left on the Jackie Robinson. You guys spent 50 bucks on, in one transaction to get an entry. There you go. All right, so let's do the 79 Opeachy Baseball real quick. Pack 23. Okay, okay I have Roger, Grant, Cortland, Scott, and Ramon. I think most of you guys are watching, so that's great. This is for a 1979 Opeachy Baseball Pack 23. All right, good luck, guys. Let me refresh the camera. Okay, three times, three times. One, two, three. No Problem, guys. Thank you. Here we go. Ramon, first card. Which one? 70 tops. 70, 70. It wasn't a solo, the wax pack. Basketball. Oh, pack eight? Yeah. Pack 
Yep, yeah, pack eight. Wait, what is that? Semi toss. No, that's baseball. That's baseball. No, no, you're looking for. Semi toss basketball wax pack seven. Wax pack seven. Semi toss basketball. Uh, Kenneth March was the last person. All right, Ramon, here we go. Good luck. Later, Scotty. Tuesday. All right, Ramon, first card. Dave McKay. Dave McKay. Wow. I am not shocked at the centering. Typical peachy. Roger. Bill Lee. No? Didn't he say Sam Lee sold out? Right? Yeah, that's what he said, 70. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, two spots belong to... Um, check, check PayPal. Uh, Dino. Dino Bates. It's, it's a PayPal. Uh, okay, hold on. Check PayPal. Go to go to PayPal. Next up, uh, car three, Cortland, Freddie, Patek, Patek. Ramon, Glenn Burke. This actually looks nice. Look at the center on this, guys. That is a very well centered Opichi car. <laughs> Glenn, I mean, it's Glenn Burke, but still, the centering is amazing. Uh, I, had, I, ch I checked and I closed it by mistake. Dino Bates. Who are you, Dino? Dino purchased two spots. All right, I got. I gotta look into it. Okay, hold on. Let me finish this pack. Uh, that was Ramon Scott. This is your Scott. Ivan de Jesus. Ivan de Jesus. It's a little off-centered, left to right, but you know that's typical in the OPG. Ramon, you get the next four. Rick Waits. Also looks very good on this on the centering. Maybe a little skewed, but still nice. Ramon Larry Herndon. Ramon George Foster. National League All Star. Ramon, Don, Money. This one barely has a left edge, but it's you can see a little bit. And Grant, Craig, uh, Greg Nettles for the Yankees. Leo guys, 1979 Opichi Baseball. 
pack 23. Alright guys, so we're trying to get the names for the 70 Toss Basketball, but we're having some issues. Looks like to be from PayPal. Um, Bob, yeah, I mean, there was a couple really well-centered cards on that one. Um, okay, so I need to know who purchased into the last 70 Toss basketball pack uh, because I believe Dino, Dino Bates, I know your PayPal is pending. Um, I'm still missing two other names, right? Two or three? Two? There's five in Magento? Yeah. So Dino has two. So three. I, I, need, I need three more, three more uh, names, unless somebody purchased three spots. So it's kind of hard to find out who. I know Dino is one, so I'll put him to the side. Brian, Brian Deitch, did you purchase a seventy toss basketball spot? What was the entry for those? All right, so let me look it up. Uh, that was pack seven, right? Okay, this is what I got, guys. This is what I got so far. I'm gonna put it all on the board. So this is what I got so far, guys, uh, in my software that went through just fine. I got Joe with one spot, Brian with one spot, Sal with one spot, Kenneth March, two spots, Dino, Dino, I know I saw your purchases. It's still pending, but we know you're good for it because we've seen you purchase before. I'm missing three names, guys. I'm missing three names. All right, so I need to know who, who made those three pass because it didn't go through. It's still pending on PayPal, most likely. Uh, let me see, Miguel. Miguel, uh, what time? That sounds about right. Today's the 31st. Yeah, okay, I got Miguel. Miguel's one spot. Alright, Miguel, it looks like you bought one spot. Your payment is also pending through PayPal. I, I still need two more spots. Justin. Justin. Justin Fountain. It looks like your purchase is also pending. I, I need one more spot. I need one more spot. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to talk to Wayne because I still need to find out who who's the last spot. Miguel, Justin, Dino, Miguel, Miguel, oh, Manuel, Manuel, hold on, Manuel, yes, I got you, Manuel, Ortega, you got a spot in the 87 Fear Basketball and 70 Tots Basketball Pack 7, all right, Manuel. All right, I got my 10. 
Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, guys, uh, we're, we're going to have to wait on the 70 Tops basketball. Um, I got the names. Dino Bates, Miguel Cuaron, Justin Fountain, and Manuel Ortega. Your payments are pending in PayPal. So we're just going to wait for the weekend, let it go through. Um, it's not like we don't trust you guys. It's just that, you know, from we can't see it in the software, so it won't show up. Um, so by the time Tuesday night hits, I'm sure it'll go through. There shouldn't be any issues. Um, if you guys want to check on your side, by all means, uh, it, it's just PayPal. They're reviewing the purchases. So... Dino, Miguel, Justin, and Manuel. Kenneth, you're good. Sal, you're good. Brian, you're good. And Joe, you're good. Sorry, guys. We just can't break in until those payments go through. So, um, but I do have the names. And this is for Basketball Pack 7. All right. I'm going to email myself these this list anyway <laughs> that's the spirit Joe Okay, so the names are good. I have it on our records. Uh, I'm just gonna wait till Tuesday night, just verify it. I'm sure it'll go through, and then we can open it Tuesday night. Tuesday night, guys. Pack seven, Tuesday night. Okay, let's continue. Uh, there was one person who wanted to see a pack. Uh, Seventy-four tops. Baseball Pack Twenty Two. Okay, you're up. Yeah. Uh, can I get one more pack? Uh, Seventy four tops, please. Well. Uh, one, two, you know, I have it right here. Yes, a spots. Thank you, sir. All right, so. Who was it? Ted. Ted Halson. 74 Toss Baseball. Pack 22. It's coming up next. After this 1980 Toss Baseball. Let me refresh the camera. Okay. Pack 58. So, that? so, John, I know we're backed up a bunch, but we're going to do the 70 Tops basketball, uh, which we got ready for you. Oh, we are doing it? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to do that one tonight, and then 72 Tops hockey. Oh, uh, I think so you're going to wait on that one. No, 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 we're going we're to open this up. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's why I pulled it. Yep. Okay. All right. Yeah, no, I wrote in the chat to the guy that we're going to open it tonight. Okay. Yep. All right. <laughs> Sounds good. I don't mind opening it. So, all right, guys, so... Uh, per Layton, we're going to open up the 70 Toss basketball pack. Sounds good to me. Uh, it's fun. So, 1980 Toss baseball pack 
This is for a 1980 Tops Baseball Wax Pack 58 break. Good luck to everyone. 10 times on the random. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Scott, you're in this one too. Nice. Scott Dinius. Hope I'm saying it right. 1980 Toss Baseball Pack 58. All right, here we go, guys. Scott, you get the first card right here. Scott Don Money. <clears throat> Chris Tickner. What's up, Chris? Wayne Gross. Chris. All right, I know that. Nice. <laughs> All right, Chris. Dave Lemanzik. Dave Lemanzik. That's what I'm sticking to. Dave Lemanzik. Chris. Mickey Klutz. Oh, Keith, you're in this one. I just noticed you. Card number six, all right. All right, uh, Chris Tickner, there you go. Card number five, L. Hrabowski? Uh, I think that's what it is. You know, I, I, don't for, I always forget how to say his name. L. Hrabowski. Uh, that's not it. Keith, I believe you will like this card. Joe Necro. I like that Astros uniform. It's awesome. John Larry Parrish. Rabowski. Oh, I was so close. Thanks, Rocco. Mario Caesar Geronimo. Chris, the Mad Hungarian, Rabowski, Rabowski. How is that Rabowski? I have no idea. Huh? This guy's last name is Rabowski, but. That is, that's not spelled Rabowski. No. No. Where is it? No. It's that guy with the HR. Yeah. Rabowski. Get out of here, Rabowski. I think Fox is a Rua. I know. Yeah, that's it's another it's one. It's <laughs> Chris, victory, victory leaders with Joe Necro, Phil Necro, and Mike Flanagan. John, future stars, Cubbies. Nobody that I heard of. Chris, Larry Bittner. The mad Hungarian. Why was he, he so mad? What happened? Just anger issues? Road rage? What was it? John Daniel, Yankees team card. With Dick Hauser. That's your manager. It's a nice card. 13. Benny Ayala for Patrick Williams. It's not bad, right, Keith? Yeah, glad you like it. 
Yeah, I love that uniform. That star on the side. It's awesome. Chris. Frank Taveras. Ah. Hall of Famer coming up for Matt Payne. <clears throat> Goose Gossage. You got the names for me? Oh. Yeah, you got it right. Which one was in for? Oh, I got it. I got it myself. The Sunday Toss Pack. <laughs> there you go, guys. 1980 Toss Baseball Pack 58 in the books. No, he didn't. Did he really? Medulla Amblagada. <laughs> Nineteen seventy four tops baseball pack twenty two. This is for uh Hey Freddy, what's up Freddy? Have a nice holiday man. Enjoy your day off on Monday. Uh, I know I will. Who was asking for this one? Who was that? Ted, Ted Halson. This one's for you, man. Okay, I start local recording. This is for a 1974 Toss Baseball Pack 22. 22. Here we go. Nine. Nine times. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Jim Chu with the first card. Okay, let me refresh the camera. Okay. All right, Jim. Good luck. First card right here. I think it's Sammy. That's Sammy. Okay, next. <coughs> yep, we can do the next thing. Jim. Ken Henderson for the White Sox. <laughs> I didn't know that. That's crazy. I can see why they will call him that. Makes sense. John Daniel. Hall of Famer. Frank Robinson. John, this looks very nice. Very nice. I like the centering. It's a little skewed left to right, um, but solid card. Hall of Famer, Frank Robinson. Ted, good luck, Ted. Your first card. Oh, Ted. Bill Singer, but man, is it miscut. Oh, boy. I don't know. Ted, not a good start. Let's get, let's get one better for you, all right? Let's see the next card. Ugh. Chicago White Sox manager Chuck Tanner. Oh, Tops. You're killing us here, Tops. Look at that miscut, huh? Awful. Jason. Bobby Mitchell. Bobby Mitchell for the Brewers.
Looks like we're gonna grade that in the house. All right, PSA on the Frank Robinson. For John Daniel. John, we're gonna grade that in the house for free. It'll be back in around three or four months, just to let you know. So take your time. No rush. Uh six. Ted. Ted Hawson. Come on, Ted. No more miscuts, huh? Alright. Ken McMullen. Ken McMullen. At least it's not miscut, Ted. It's a little off-centered, but it's not miscut completely, like the other two. Jason. Ross Grimsley traded. And Brandon, the last card. It's Larry Gura, also traded. This one though got the worst of the wax pack on the the wrapper. Um, there you go. There you go, guys. Seventy four toss baseball pack twenty two. Rocco is awful. It was awful. I feel bad for Ted. He was asking for that pack, and he just, ugh, miscut like a mother. All right. There you go. Next up. You want to do Facebook for this one? Yeah. <laughs> this is what's coming up, guys. Pack number seven. Where is it? Setting up Facebook. Opening our third of the 1970, uh, 1970 Tops basketball. Oops. Basketball. Of the day. What's up, Facebook? We're about to open up our third, our, oh, <laughs> wait, what? Our third 1970 Toss Basketball Wax Pack of the day. So, have fun, good luck. If you want to see a different angle, go to uh, youtube.com slash vintage breaks. Okay. Guys on YouTube and Breakers TV, here we go. 1970 Toss Basketball Wax Pack 7. 7. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, good luck to Joe, Brian, Sal, Kenneth, Dino, Miguel, Justin, and Manuel. Good luck to you guys. Let me refresh the camera. Okay, here we go. Eight times, eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, here we go.
Sal, your first card right here. You ready? Come on, baby. Give me something good here. Nothing but well-centered, beautiful, vivid color cards. So the poster, I will rent them off at the end. So somebody will get that poster. Um, this is for later. Okay, so first card. Bob Rule for Seattle. YouTubers first. There you go. It's good. Hey, Ken. How are you? Yep. Okay. Next up, Dino. Gail Goodrich. I always forget if he's a Hall of Famer, John. Maybe our uh, fans uh, on YouTube can tell us. I feel like he is. Beautiful color on its card. Yep. Former Laker. There you go, Dino. Good? Beautiful. Kenneth. Wow. Wally Anderzunas. For the Royals. That was the Cincinnati Royals. So extremely sharp. Just a little bit of OC left to right. Wow, Ken's uh, watching from his car. Hopefully not while he's driving. <laughs> I'll be pulled over. <laughs> yeah, maybe he's eating a sandwich or something. Miguel, here we go. I need this now. Yeah, I like that because it also advertises us constantly. <laughs> it's great. Keith Erickson for the that Lakers. That's pretty good from here. So anything that's great about this pack, we're going to do it on the house. Okay. So I would grade that. You got a chance at a nine. It depends on the centering and I have to measure it. But regardless, I would grade the Keith Erickson at first glance. Oh, Facebook. Good. Yep, so we'll do that on the house. Whose card was that? Card for Miguel. Miguel. Congratulations. Good luck, Dino. Who's come, uh, his card's coming up. So, Miguel, we're going to send this to PSA, okay? Expect about three or four months before it gets back. So, that's why I'm, I'm always telling people we should ask them, because it's not so much that they don't want it graded, it's that it just takes a real long time. Miguel, if you don't want to get graded, just let me know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll Email do it, us. We'll do it on the house, but yeah. either way, we understand. Info at VintageBreaks.com if you don't want to get graded, because <laughs> we don't mind. It's okay. Dino, card number five. Johnny Egan for Cleveland. Oh, that's cool. It has the line up top. I don't know about you, but I like that little line. Well, it's like a production line. Yeah. I mean, clearly, uh, it's very interesting. You know, it looks like he's wearing a Laker uniform almost. I wonder if he was traded. Because I thought that John Egan might have been a Laker. Yep. That's what it was? Los Angeles the year yeah, before. Yeah, so he was just traded over and they didn't have him in his Cleveland uniform mm -hmm. yet. Very interesting. Kenneth, card six. Bobby Smith. Very sharp, just a little bit off-centered left to right. Another sharp pack, Bob. Yes, indeed. Joe! Joe, is this your first card? Yeah, I wouldn't Joe. Mind. I wouldn't mind putting together my set like this, John. <laughs> Joe, here we go. First card for you, my friend. Ooh, nice card. Uh, Larry goes. Siegfried. Larry Siegfried. I, figure, I feel like he used to be a Celtic, and I bet you if you look at the back, he was probably traded. Yeah, that's a gorgeous card. Just a hair off uh, on the top, left to right, but still of eight quality. Lane, do you think I get my 75 Rico Pitrocelli y'all pull for me a few weeks ago? Personally, autograph then PSA grade. Wow, William. <laughs> <laughs> so um, I am in talks with Rico. Uh, so this was Jim's idea from just about a week or two ago that we were going to take the few 68 Rico Petroselli cards that we got from the set break and get those signed. Okay. So even if we sent them out, my point is I think what I'm going to try to do with Rico from now on is anytime we get a Rico card, whether it be from a set break or a wax pack, 
Obviously, it's up to the individual. Some folks may not want their card signed. Okay. But um, I asked Tom to talk to Rico, and I think it's going to be fine. All right. So, William, just go ahead and email Layton. Layton yeah. at justcollect.com. This way, he'll have it in his uh, inbox. Um, and he'll I now have a Rico out. folder. Yeah. He has a Rico <laughs> folder. So. Uh, card eight. Brian. Good luck, Brian. One spot in this pack. I want to see a Jabbar. That's what I want to see. You ask? No. Oh, my goodness. Uh, I thought it was a base, but still. Is that the number one card? Yes. Wow. Okay. So, guys, this is a big deal because PSA 8s of this and higher are not only big bucks, but they're really hard to find. Let me check this out. Wow. Wow. So, that's a gorgeous card. Maybe it's a smidge off-centered, top to bottom, left to right. Looks gorgeous. Looks like a solid PSA 8 in my book. Happy to grade that for you, Brian, on the house. Oh, wow. That's a gorgeous <laughs> Beautiful. Let's make sure we Instagram that, or you know, I know Mike takes uh, some photos at the end of the night. Okay. Yeah, if you send that to me with, against the Vintage Breaks logo, I'll uh, tweet it out and stuff. We'll uh, hit up Chris with that. It's a great, great card. I feel bad, by the way. I called Chris before to let him know. So originally he was going to come up the week after. Works out that he can come up next week. Okay. So he's coming up. So I called him. I think he was totally dead sleeping. Yeah. I mean, you must be tired. You <laughs> like worked real late, yeah. got up super early. Oh yeah. Um, okay, so PSA for Brian. Brian. Brian says do it. Great. Yeah, it's great. Brian, that's okay. a great card. And also, and a nine. I bet you it's probably north of a thousand bucks. Who was the other one? Uh, Joe wants to know off. if he wants to get graded. Joe is seven. Cards. Yeah, I'm gonna check it out. He wants to get it graded. Oh, I would definitely get this graded. Okay. Yeah, because even if it comes back a straight eight, the card looks like a nine, almost a ten. It's just a, a hair off center. Yeah, I would definitely get it graded. We're Joe, for you guys. Joe, you got it. Joe, PSA. And of course, Brian, PSA 8. Well, they're not going to see it in person, so might as well show it off to him. He's gorgeous take, card. He's going to take a screenshot, probably. Here yep, you go. I like that. There you go, Brian. Take a nice screenshot of that. Let me move the glare. All right. And speaking of glare, John, we're very excited. In the next two weeks, we're going to be upgrading our studio slash set here with some lighting, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. With some, I, what did he, he said exhibit. I don't know what that means, but... I know that it's going to make the set look better. Oh, yeah? Yeah, yeah. I'm not oh. sure exactly what it means. I got to find out for him. Right. Where's the backdrop? The PSA and the vintage break? Oh, uh, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's in the works, definitely. Yeah, so that and then the uh, the lights are going to be better with, with no glare or less glare. It's going to be great. Awesome. So this is for Manuel. I ask and I shall receive. I got Mr. Jabbar. That makes me so happy. <laughs> Flynn Robinson. Gorgeous car, just a little, little OC top to bottom. Top to bottom. Joe, don't worry about it. It's on the house. Facebook. Yeah. So, William, if you'd like to get spots in our breaks, you can join us at vintagebreaks.com. You can buy your spots there anytime. But if you'd like to watch us live, we generally do it on youtube.com slash vintagebreaks. Tuesday through Fridays, our schedule varies. You can always check our website, vintagebreaks.com, for our exact schedule. And you can learn about how we operate, all the ins and outs on vintagebreaks.com. And click on the FAQ link. Okay, so we're up to ten, the tenth card. This is going to Justin. And good old Tops gave us an extra card. Wow, amazing! Thank you, Tops. <laughs> this is for our pleasure, William. Justin. This is nice Jeff card, Mullins. Yeah, that's you know probably right on the border of nine quality, more likely an eight because of the centering top to bottom, but it depends. I mean. You gotta really take out the ruler, John, when it's that close, yeah. because it, even if it falls right on the border, if it looks that nice, you more than likely will get a nine because it's pack fresh. They can tell. So what do you think? Oh, if you'd like to grade it, we're happy to do that for him. But I don't want him to be disappointed. I think it might come back either straight eight or nine OC. It just depends. Okay, Manuel, let me know if you want to get that graded, Manuel. But we're happy to do that for him. Absolutely. Oh, it's Manuel Ortega. He, he, he doesn't chat. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna write to him. Sure. PSA question mark. And then email us. Manuel, just email us info at vintagebreaks.com. Let me know if you want PSA or not. Dino, Dino, card number two. Oh, he wants to know if this is worth grading. Gail Goodrich. It's probably an 80C, which is a six. I wouldn't grade it. Sorry, Dino. It's probably not worth creating on this one. 
And then the it's very one, sharp. It's just a little bit too off center. Five. And card five, no, because it has the line on top. Probably not. So Dino, you know, unfortunately, the two cards not worth grading, man. If you want to get graded regardless, just email us. We'll do it for a fee. Uh, but let me know. All right. So the last card is Mike Riordan. Looks interesting from here uh, in terms Can of. I, oh, okay. Oh, thank so you, a sir. little bit off center, top to bottom. I couldn't tell at first, but still very, very sharp. So you're gonna random that one off. It's gonna random off as well as the poster. Very cool. So this is gonna be random off, guys. Someone's gonna get an extra card. How many cards in this set? It's a good question, Joe. Um, I believe. Let's see. 1970 Chance Basketball complete set. So there are 175 cards in the set. 175. Keep? Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. Uh, I'm going to random off the names one more time. First person on top will get the, uh, the Mike Riordan card. Second place will get the poster, which is... Oh, nice. Willis Reed. Willis Reed poster. Okay. First, second. First, second. Oh, man. Dusty cards. Ah, oh, I have to sneeze, guys. Hold on. <laughs> Woo! Dust materials. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> Joe, that's funny. Eight times. Top two at eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And top two are. Kenneth, March, and Brian. Kenneth, you get the extra card. Kenneth, you're getting the extra card. Mike Riordan. Just a little OC. <laughs> Kenneth. And Brian. Brian, you're getting the poster. <laughs> hey, what's up, Mark? Oh, Mark, I think I opened up some packs for you, man. Here you go. You got a bag? Where's the... I had a bag there. Oh no, you just left it like that, that's fine. So this is 70 tops. Uh, thanks guys, that's the, uh, that is the break. Pack seven. Do I have to break it right now? Uh, I can't. He has it. Okay. What? <laughs> Snapper. Yes, yeah, Snapper. Let's find out. Uh, I probably have to refresh. Uh, 5.51. 5.51 p.m. is the last time somebody purchased anything. And I need one, two, three, four, five, six. I need six more spots to fill it up. All right, so let's find out. Uh, OK. 
Okay, let's see if the sniper filled. Yeah, and if you don't have enough names, there's a couple names I was going to put in there. So Okay. So, Steve, 551 p.m. is so the last time you purchased. Let's find out whose name I have to add. All right, 551, 551. Kenneth March, you're next. Kenneth, all right, you get four spots. Yeah, man, that's why I jumped again. That's it, yeah, because it's going to fill up. Yeah. yeah, I need two more names, guys. Two more. Here we go. I'm going by timestamp. It's first come, first serve. Brian, you're next at 622. Yep, that's it. Closed. All right, guys, it's closed. Brian, you get the last two spots. That's spending a hundred. All right, Jason, thank you for your purchases, man. All right, guys, we filled that up. Let's ran them off. It's a nice, nice snapper. Here it is. Good luck to everyone. I hope Jackie finds a nice home. Okay, let me record. Let me just refresh the camera. All right, this is for a snapper, which includes this beautiful 1954 Tops Jackie Robinson PSA 3 for first place. Second place is getting a $50 break credit. Third place, a 1983 Tops Baseball Wax Pack, a whole pack. All right, let's randomize it. Three times. Top three, guys, top three. Mark. I really did enjoy opening all that stuff too. So, um, glad you got the package in your mail. We still, you still have more coming. Don't worry. All right, guys. Here we go. Three times. Three times a charm. One. Oh, Brian. Two. Oh, Dino. There you go. <laughs> and the winner of the Jackie Robinson after three times is. Justin Fountain. I think that's new. He's new. Yeah. yeah. Congratulations, Justin. Justin. Very cool. It's a great card. It really is. Justin, congrats. Here are my top three. Yeah, there's two other prizes. Justin Fountain. Welcome to Vintage Breaks. There is your 54 Jackie Robinson. PSA 3. That's going out to you. Congrats. Second place is Kenneth. Kenneth March, you're getting a $50 Bricker credit. Oh, Kenneth March, there you go. $50. And Steve Venom, coming in DJ. late. DJ. There you go, Steve. You're getting an 83 Tops Baseball Wax Pack. Congrats. Congrats, Steve. You got anything uh, to mention or highlight or anything? Nope. No, you're good? Okay. Get back. You take it? Okay, so guys, that is the snapper for today. There's the three prizes. Congrats to Justin, Kenneth, and Steve. Or DJ Venom. All right, there you go. Thank you, sir. Oops, I'm with us. Yeah, thanks. Uh, we're good? All right, guys, on behalf of myself, Johnny Five, Layton, and Rob. And Chris, and Mikey, and, and Gelf, we're growing. We're and growing everybody family. else, yes. <laughs> uh, it's been fun, guys. Thank you for hanging out with me on this uh, beautiful Friday. Uh, have a nice holiday weekend. Hope Tuesday, to see you guys. Tuesday, we're going to do it at 4 because Chris is coming back next week. Okay, so Tuesday, guys, we'll be back on at 4 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, shout out to Steve, Mark, Joe, Jim, Chris, uh, Bob, Mark, William, everybody, William, and Dino, and Jay, and Mr. Russo. Way too many of you guys. Uh, Thanks so much, guys. I really appreciate thing. it. Have a great time this weekend with your friends and family. See, all right, see you guys.